Hey Paint Dudes, Peter Von Panda here. Hey, I uh, just uh, uh, wanted to show you my hinge dock uh, click connection uh, piece, uh, basically a docking module for your Apple Bluetooth keyboard and Bluetooth trackpad. And so one of the things that I realized is that um, a lot of times you'll probably be moving around, especially since these are wireless and Bluetooth, and especially if you have a your screen connected to, or your computer connected to two different screens, it's nice to move the keyboard to kind of get yourself angled. Um, this piece will hold both of these two devices together. And the way it does it, and you've probably seen, is that uh, it's just this nice kind of molded white plastic, you know, depending on what you see in the pictures. It's not aluminum finished. It's a pretty good match for the, the uh, white keys on the Apple keyboard, but these are a little bit more matte, and this is kind of a shiny, slippery plastic. But it's really easy to mount things. You kind of want to put them, uh, put the, the leading edge in first, and then just push it down, and it's going to hold it in there. The the, uh, the round molded edge is going to put a little bit of pressure on it. Same for the trackpad. You kind of put that front leading edge in and just push it down. And now, a couple of things, and I've been using this for uh, several months, is that you want to make sure that you get this front edge down because if, if, you, if you push it in and it's not down, and even sometimes after using it, it can kind of move around a little, it, uh, this, this uh, edge of the uh, dock can kind of hold the clicking, the trackpad um, down uh, kind of put enough pressure on it that it's holding the click position down. So just want to make sure it's all nice and pushed in there. Um, and so you get one nice solid piece uh, to kind of move around and you don't have to worry about moving uh, the keyboard and the trackpad separately. Then uh, the other thing to keep in mind here is that on the flip side, because of the power key, the power buttons are on the side of the trackpad on the, uh, the kind of the spine where the batteries go, you're wondering how do I access my power button? And so for the um, for the trackpad, it's easy because they put this uh, plastic button here on the edge. When you hold that in, it just presses in this battery, but you run into the problem where that same button on the keyboard is not available. So they put in this little switch here that uh, moves in and out and basically is uh, pushing in that button so if you hold it in to turn it off or hold it into pair or press it once to turn it on um, you can do that without having to pop the keyboard out of uh, of the dock which is nice so you have this button here for the trackpad and this this little switch here which acts as a as a as pressure on the button for the key, keyboard but great device for only about 30 bucks kind of brings everything together again you know the plastic is a little you know has a little bit of contrast which i actually don't mind um but uh you know just keep in mind it's not in a, a brushed aluminum or silver finish uh that would kind of blend away so uh but the fit and finish is so good it actually looks like stock piece and i've actually had people ask where i got this keyboard because they don't realize that this is the official uh apple um, Bluetooth keyboard they think it's a it's a single piece all in and of itself so nice product uh, you know and I use it with my other hinge products so uh, pick it up I'll put a link on the site Peter Von Panda out